now Serbia and Poland match up for the last game. It's the mountaintop. The man who will get that gold. Kovacevic left wide open, misses it. But Antic with the rebound. Kovacevic mishandles it. Shetka. And foul against Milosantic. Watch your bitch. Hands it off. Oh, yes. The one hand wonder finish. Guczki putting Poland on the board. One zip. Stojanovic keeps up with the heat that he brought since the knockout round. 2 1. And Mikalis answering right back up. This boy has a rocket launcher. Mikalis and Lazic saying, I can do it too. But he's off balance and the ball goes too much to the right. Air ball. Poland gets possession back. The ball inside, Boguczki. Trying to seal Lazic, but he was out the paint. Zushetka going right at Antic. And the ball given back to Serbia. Who will be on top of the world? We will find out in 8 minutes and 51 seconds. Stojanovic sizzling through the defense with the killer crossover. And Zlushetka put on the line, meaning he did not clear the zone. See the highlights, Stojanovic. So nine seconds left on the 12 second shot clock. Kovacevic with the ball. And he elevates using the glass. Yes, that counts whenever you're in time of need. Call upon your best friend, Mr. Backboard. He will bail you out. Boguczki with his version of the hook shot. There's a foul in the back. Sitnik gets called for it. Kovacevic pounds on his chest, saying, I got you, baby. Eight minutes and 20 seconds. Stojanovic, two man action with Kovacevic. Oh, the behind the back pass. Kovacevic going back to back daggers. 7-3! And Sitnik going right at Stojanovic. He's too strong and Stojanovic forgot his luggage on that trip. Turnover, unforced error. 7-4. Kalis hands it off. Zlashetka gives it back to the shooter. Great closeout defense, Lazic. That's tough. And the foul on Kovacevic, holding Boguczki on the close on the box out. Kaliz Zlushetka finds Boguczki, and Boguczki going under. Good defense from Lazic pushing back, and the great transition. Zlushetka getting called for holding Kovacevic. Serbia. Three point lead. Well, 
Lazic, the great flash, but Zitnik focused on the play. Milo Santic. With the dive right to the middle. Seven seconds. Also Janovic and Lazic partying it up. The way they connected. And the ball earned back. Lashetka better give that ball back if he doesn't want to get a warning. Lazic and Stojanovic just moving around, making Poland confused. And Kovacevic. And the foul on the shot attempt. There's going to be two free throws. Oh, Kovacevic staying away from the paint. He's like, I'm not trying to battle it out with Boguchki. And it is a foul, no questions asked. You can't talk about it. Can't act confused. He's going up. He grabbed the hand. And Kovacevic putting Serbia on his shoulders early in this game. Six points for Kovacevic out of 10. Zlushetka. Pulls back. And no one can control this ball. Zlushetka, great take. Stojanovic sees their light. Moves to the left. He's patient with it. All oh, the crossover with the kick. TV timeout. Serbia with a commanding five point lead. They got possession of the ball. Let's see what Poland will come out with at the timeout. Janovic with the ball, broad elbow action. So now Stojanovic, oh, he dribbles on his own leg. And then he commits the foul trying to recover the ball. Zlushetka, no look time! Bebogutski getting no love on the rims. Zlushetka could make it a two point piece. Too far. And now Serbia can increase the lead. And they got the matchup that they want. Kovacevic inside and Lazic going with the left. And Kovacevic patient with it, finishing the job down low. So Edmund Ho. Wants to check something at the table. So, eleven five. 12 second shot clock. Zlushetka drawing the foul. Lazic pushing on the body. Zlushetka knocks it down. 11-6. Stojanovic snatched Zlashetka's ankles. Oh, that was mean, man. What did Zlashetka do to you? Oh, can't wait to see that one again. Stojanovic 
found his groove in this competition at the most important point. Zlushetka, great hands, Milo Santic, yet again doing all those little details that make the difference for Team Serbia. Peak, re peak, kicks it out, Kovacevic, top of the key, no. Bogucki, Zlushetka. And the hands yet again, the deflection, Milo Santic, most, oh, how, how do you say, best defensive player of the tournament for sure, Lazic, right over Bogucki, what were you thinking? He's seven footer, he blocks it. Kovacevic, going right to the baseline, using his speed, but no. The ball, given back to Serbia. I like the thought process, Kovacevic just staying wide, keeping Bogucki out the paint. He can shoot and that prevents him from, ooh, that prevents him from being able to uh, contest all those shots close to the basket. Bogucki, yes sir, oh! I did not expect that miss. I thought that was an easy bucket and Kovacevic Holds on to the ball tight. 15 foul against Poland. It's the first time that Poland and Serbia matches up in this level of competition. Mikalis, a little bit long, but Bogucki, that's easy. 13 7, Lazic. Leaves the pain before the three-second shot clock. Violation in the crossover. Stojanovic, he's shifty with it, isn't he? And he adds the great outside shooting to the shiftiness. Green up the shooter. Stojanovic sidestepping. Oh, 15-7. And Milo Santic tries to contest as well as he can. Tough matchup though against Bakuchki. Lazic elevates. Stojanovic thinking about it. Thinking about it no more. Kalis, great pump fake, relocate and knocks it down. Mikalis making this game a five point game. Milosantic in the direct driving lane. Boguchki contesting. And the foul. Gets Adrian Boguchki. TV timeout. We are under the four minute mark. Boguchki a bit frustrated with that call. Poland with 16 fouls. Oh, oh, oh. Stojanovic looking pretty. Ugh. I make the stink face. You know what the stink face is? Well, I can show you. I'm not on camera, but this is like, uh, that's what it looks like. Uh. And Serbia leading 15 10. They'll have the ball, top of the key. Kovacevic, right now, winning his matchup with Bogucki. Stojanovic, he pops out. Kovacevic, let me say the name. 17-10, and he dares Sidney to shoot. He literally backed up in the paint. He's like, I don't believe you can make that, buddy. Kovacevic says, just give me that damn ball. Because I want to knock that one down. And he's going to shoot it again. No, gives it up to Stefano. No, no, no. Too long. Stojanovic and Lazic with the steal. Draws the seventh team foul. Serbia, more than ever, on its way to the gold medal. Poland running out of option. Nikola Lazic, one of the best shooters in this competition, with an opportunity to give Serbia a nine point lead. He misses the first.
How about the big man Kovacevic? MVP hands down, the big man showing. I can switch it up on you. He pretty much did not even take a two point shot attempt all tournament, maybe one, no more than two. And in the final, he literally just took over with his long range touch. He's popping off, oh, oh. And now he drives, he ends it off. This is Basketball Academy for you right there. Milosantic contesting everything, Serbia. They're gonna let Mikhail Lee score, no need to foul. Time is on their side, 18-12. Kovacevic, great hands from Gucci. And Mikhail Lee will have another go at it. Daylight, oh, short. Kovacevic taking his sweet time. Lazic, long range, Mr. Laser. Up to the left. Mikhail Lees gives it up to Boguchki. Oh. Makes it look easy, doesn't he? 18 13. And the pop action. Kobachevich again, again. Hey, a little bit long. I'm getting hyped, you gotta understand. The big man, he's just putting on the shooting clinic in the final. Have you watched the competition? Well, I watched every game. Did you watch Kovacevic shooting from the two-point lane during the, during the tournament? No, you didn't. Amazing. So, 18-13. Serbia, up five. But how about Poland making this game interesting? What if Poland manages to pull off a great comeback and put it to the last possession? I know the Serbian fans don't want to hear that. I understand. I'm sure the Polish fans want to hear that. But as a basketball fan, I just want to make it last longer. I'm telling you, it's just, we're coming off to a great finish. It's like five amazing days of competition and this is the summit. We are on top of the mountain right now. And I just want to make it last forever. Mikalis elevates short. Less than two minutes to go now. Stojanovic. Mies handles the ball. Turns it over. Still a long time. A minute 52 is like two hours in 3x3. Lushetka. Going opposite. And Milosantic saying, take that out of here. Oh, man. I'm telling you, this guy is doing it all. I talked about Milan Chaput for the U18, doing all the dirty work, being there when the team needs him the most, and Milos Antic doing everything they need for them to get that gold medal defensively. Stojanovic, open lane, bucket, 19-13. Does Poland believe still in this win? I don't know. Kovacevic, seventh team foul, meaning two free throws coming up for the big giant. You're going to tell me a giant is big. Well, well, you have giants and giants, and he's a big giant. Adrian Boguczki, the Polish beast, with two free throws. Trying to cut this lead down to five. A minute 21 left. The big man knocks the first one down. And two for two. So what will Serbia do? No need to rush it though. Both teams in foul trouble. And Lazic gets it over the hand of Boguchki. They're not gonna foul. Lazic will leave him. Of course, 2016, they just need one point. Lazic to the cup, no. Lushetka pulls it back and the ball go with the two pointer. He's gonna have two free throws. What's going on? Oh my god! Milo Santic touched the ground. Well, I did say, how great would it be 
if we could have the game going up to the last possession, super close and everything. And Zlachetka heard me because we got a Bluetooth connection. Oh, missing the first free throw. But, 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 but. He still can make the second one, which means that with a stop and a two-point shot, Poland can win. But Serbia only needs one point. Zlachetka with the ball to try to make this game a one possession game, and he does. So, check ball at the top. Oh, I'm getting up. I'm not sitting down no more. I'm getting up. I'm getting up. I'm standing. I'm sure you see me on the screen. I'm standing. I can't sit down. Stoyanovic going to the cup. Oh! Hey, Kovacevic! Draws! No! Kovacevic, no foul on the play. So now, Serbia needs to cover the two-point lane. Slyshetka. Great defense from Kovacevic. No foul. Oh, mama. Stojanovic going to the cup. And Antic. Oh, my God. Slyshetka for the game winner. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Heartbreaker for Serbia. Oh, the emotion. What a legendary game. Legendary game. Oh, wow. 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 Oh my God. Jesus. This is 3x3. You have to understand this is what happens. Serbia, heartbroken. Two giants battling for gold. This is incredible. This is incredible. I mean, wow. 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 I feel for those kids both ways. I feel for the winners. I feel for the losers. I understand how they feel both sides. And wow. Wow. Wow, wow. What an incredible ending to the show. We're gonna have a flash interview. Oh, baby. Wow. What a crazy ending. What can you say about the last two-pointer? Uh, it was a really hard game. We wanna thank Serbia for competing until the last minute. Uh, I think we like to make our things harder. And you know, just find a way out on the end. I'm really happy that we won. Thank you everybody for cheering, for cheering for us. And we are happy. Last year, Poland won the Nations League here in Bucharest as well. This year, you are under 23 World Cup winners also here. How much does that competition help you to prepare for games like this? Uh, it's really amazing. Like to represent your country like on this kind of level, at this, uh, at this kind of parties. Uh, Romanian Basketball Federation done a really good job like doing a tournament like that right here. And like I said, we are happy that we are able like to compete against one of the best teams like on the world. It was really hard for us, but we are the first in the end and we are happy about it. Congratulations, you can celebrate now. Hey! Wow. Yes, Esteban, you can hold your head, man. You can. <laughs>